Here's how to exploit a classic iDoor vulnerability in under 30 seconds. Step 1. Log in as a normal user. Notice the numbers in the URL, like slash user slash 101. This number is your user ID. iDoor stands for Insecure Direct Object Reference. It means the website trusts the number in the URL to decide what data you can see, without checking if you should have access. Step 2. Change the ID to something else, like 102. If the page loads someone else's data, that's an iDoor. Why is this dangerous? Attackers can access, change or even delete other users' information just by guessing IDs. Think of it like using your hotel keycard to open someone else's room. If the doors aren't checked properly, anyone can get in. Boom! That's insecure direct object reference, a classic broken access control flaw. Want to test this skill legally? Try capture the flag challenges on TryHackMe or PortSwigger. Sub if you want more walkthroughs.